Okay, today we're going to remove the shock, rear shock, on a 1999 Volkswagen Passat. It's got 215,000 miles on it, and the shocks, you can tell they're leaking. They've been beat up. Getting a little weird cupping on the tires. So I thought it's time to do this. First step will be to jack up your car. Jack here, I got a jack stand there. It's not a very good car for jack stands. Uh, they're just not great points of contact. Uh, once I take the tire off, I'll put another jack stand on the axle. But I already undid the bolts. Uh, the tire. And you can see. Let's see if I can get some good video here. How about? So there's some damage right in here, and there's oil all built up around there. I'm assuming that's been leaking, the reservoir's been leaking. But there's uh, oil right around there. Oops, you can't see that. Come down. There's some oil right around there. So, out with the old. I'm going to put in uh, some brand new, uh, what are they called, KYBs. I got those over here. Nope, Bilstein. I think I might have Bilstein on the front too. They look like they're quality. Got them online. I think they're like $60. I have to look that up again. Okay, now we're looking up at the shock and you can see I have my wrench right here at 16 millimeter. Oh, pretty hard to do. Might want to get a little bit longer like a break apart. Put a, you see this is spinning in here so I'll put a wrench in there hold that tight and keep that up which is going to require two hands so so I have the wrench inside there holding that back bolt I can see that I've been doing this for a little bit you got a power tool, you should use it. I actually have one, but I'm not using it. I figure it's a good exercise. So the bolt came off. And Two bolts towards the top. There's two up there we gotta get out. Oh. 